We begin here tonight with that Rockland County fire where the flames spread so quickly some people barely had time to escape. Tonight, seven families are without a place to live after today's fire at a Nanuet apartment complex. Alicia Reed spoke to them about the terrifying ordeal and asked them what's next. Christine and Maurice, the Red Cross is currently assisting those families who lost everything here. We're told one volunteer firefighter actually picked up the keys this morning to move into his new apartment here. And all of a sudden, there was a boom. Flames erupted. A neighbor's ring camera captured the moment an apartment building at the Highlands Nanuet apartment homes went up in flames. The smoke came in through the vents through the walls, everywhere. This couple ran for their lives and managed to escape. Retired police officer Terry Miles is a recent heart transplant recipient and has a kidney transfusion appointment in the morning. They say all of his meds went up in flames. We don't know what we're going to do right now. I, I, I can't even think straight. The Rockland County Fire Coordinator says a contractor was doing work on Avalon Gardens Drive when workers started smelling gas. Fire erupted, and although officials say firefighters were on scene within minutes, the fire was too advanced. The lightweight construction prevented them from being able to fight the fire from inside. If you can get to that fire before it gets into the attic or into the windows of the apartments, definitely you can extinguish it quicker. But once it gets to the attic, they're very tough to get. It's kind of like off to the races. The building was constructed over 25 years ago and did not have sprinklers because they weren't required then. The town supervisor says police officers entered the burning building to help get tenants out. They tried to gain entry into some of the apartments up, up above, but um, uh, the fire was just too intense at that point. So far, there are no reports of any injuries, but there is still one dog that's unaccounted for. Now, as for the building, the town supervisor says once reconstructed, sprinklers will be added. In Rockland County, Alicia Reed, CBS News, New York.